Coach Jancic, welcome to Tampa. Great to be here. Fa fabulous uh, place to live. How did this come about? Obviously, the Bulls had a need. How did mm -hmm. you get intrigued about USF? I was intrigued. Um, obviously, I researched uh, Coach Taggart and his, his background and, and the things that he's been able to do in his career. And then uh, I was fortunate to, to be able to connect with him through some mutual friends. And uh, he provided an opportunity for me to come interview and uh, came down and was really, uh, really impressed not only uh, with Coach Taggart, but the rest of the staff and uh, the area. Uh, great place to, to live and raise a family. So it was exciting for me. What's your impression of the returnees in the defensive secondary in this program? I've been uh, very impressed. Uh, we've got some talent here. Uh, we've got to, got to get them coached up and uh, continue to grow. Uh, they've done a great job uh, in the past uh, with recruiting um, not just good athletes, but good character kids. I mean, I've, I can't tell you how many kids have come by and you know, introduce themselves and shake your hand and look you in the eye. And uh, it's been very refreshing, very exciting for me to work with these guys. And uh, it, it's a first class program. Uh, Coach Taggart and the staff has, has done a great job and I'm excited to be a part of the team. There's a lot of guys in the defensive secondary who got a chance to play really young. Mm -hmm. I mean, you look and there's a sophomore and he's played 19 games. That's, right. that's all the way through the secondary. Is that always an advantage? We tend to look at that as, oh, this is great. He's getting experience early. Do you find that's a positive? Oh, absolutely. Uh, you know, anytime you can gain experience uh, in, in game situations, that's a, certainly a positive. And I'm, I'm excited about the group that we have coming back. Uh, like you said, they do have some experience. And um, I'm, I'm looking forward to, to helping them get to the next level. And that's my job as a coach, to, to try and enhance their game. Um, and we got some good members back there that uh, I think we can do it with. Bulls are going to stay with the 425 mm -hmm. defensive alignment. Some of the terminology will change, but the philosophy is the same. Is that new for you? Have you ever coached in that alignment? Does it make significant changes as a coach? Uh, no, it's, I'm very familiar with that. Uh, it's, it's really just you're playing nickel, uh, nickel package, which um, I've done most of my career, uh, especially against teams that are in three and four wides. Uh, so it's, it's pretty standard. Um, there's some things uh, that we're talking about as, as a staff uh, that we're, we're looking at. And um, no, it's, it's, not a, it's not unfamiliar territory for me at all. Coach, thanks. We're glad you're here. Have a great spring. Thank you. Appreciate it.